Hey, what's up guys? This is Grease with Revenant Motors. And today we're checking out a super clean 1968 Buick GS 400. This is a pretty unique car. From what I understand, Buick made these to basically be their Chevelles. It's a performance model, so it did come equipped with the 400. You can see right there, it's got the 400 badge with the GS. And you've got the racing stripe going down right above the rocker panel. It's got the factory original light blue metallic paint. Actually pre presents very nicely. The factory black vinyl top. And you can see it's still got the original Buick wheels on it, which look very nice on this car. All the chrome is beautiful. Nice chrome exhaust tips. It looks like he's got brand new taillight lenses he put on it, last owner. Of course, you've got the GS400 in the back with the trim. Now, from what I understand, you could also get the GS350. So this is the top dog, the 400. car just shines beautifully in the sun these cars are cool because you know you see a lot of mainstream cars like the chargers and the chevelles and the kudas but i've really grown to appreciate the the oddball cars that you don't see or hear about every day so this quarter panel does have a few dings and dents in it but again this is for a driver it's presents very nicely you can see all the trim is really nice and clean and this body is very solid we inspect all our cars put them on the hoist and we'll also show you guys the undercarriage here later on in the video but i love seeing some nice clean door jams you can clearly see the skin i love that See a lot of cars nowadays where they fill over this. Very clean door jams. Still got the part number right there in the rocker. And the interior on this car is just beautiful. This was a factory AC car. At some point somebody did put a non-AC dash. Not really sure why they did that, but you still got the factory AC controls. It does turn the blower on. Again, beautiful interior. This thing is just very, very pleasant car to drive. See all the rubbers are really nice. The trim, again, the trim's beautiful. Door shut really nice. That the glass is in excellent shape too. Love that hood scoop too. That's just, I mean, this again, this is a, a performance Bu Buick car that they made. So it's really cool. It's got that mean muscle car look to it. You can see again, it's got the GS badge on the grill. Let's go take a look at the trunk here. So it has had two quarters put on it and it did have a trunk pan put in it at some point. But it was done professionally. You can see even package tray is really nice and solid and clean. Again, you can see where they, they patched in the center trunk pan, but again, it's very presentable. It's got the factory spatter finish. walk over here and check out the motor so this does have a 10 bolt rear end it's a turbo 400 trans and of course the Buick 400 engine nice real nice bonus is you got ceramic coated Doug's headers those are really nice high quality headers got an aluminum intake Holly carburetor HEI distributor 
The car runs excellent. I do have a lot of receipts for this engine build. It is documented. I mean, I've got receipts for a lot of this car, so there is a lot of documentation that's included with it. And we're gonna have Alex here fired up. Fires right up, sounds nice and healthy. Let's get behind the car here and see how it sounds. Exhaust. Just a strong running car, it's got a nice cam in it. that nice muscle car cackle to it. All right, guys, so we're gonna take the Buick up and down the strip here. Got functioning gauges. Radio works. Here we go. Car drives nice and straight. I mean, this thing just floats down the road. Drives just like a Chevelle. It's got plenty of power. No creaks or rattles that I'm hearing. We're not, we haven't seen any major mechanical issues that stood out to us. We're gonna go ahead and do a turnaround here go through the gears again you can see all the reflections off that hood the paint's beautiful on this car all right here we go second pull right here nice firm shifts wouldn't doubt the trans has a shift kit in it. Whoever put the drivetrain together did a really nice job. All right, guys, so we're gonna go ahead and check out the bottom of this Buick. It's got undercoat on the gas tank, fairly new exhaust system. Nice solid frame. Floors look good, it's been undercoated. It's definitely got original, what looks to be original floors on it. Got those beautiful Doug's headers on there. Again, those are really nice headers. You can tell the trans, motor's been gone through. Just a really solid car for a driver. Again, you got good solid floors. Definitely a good solid car to just take down the road to a local car show. Get into it at an affordable price.